G'day, I'm Warwick Schiller and today I want to talk to you about why my horse training is a bit like eating a banana. Sounds a bit funny but um, just think about when you eat a banana, a lot of people say bananas are good for potassium, you eat a banana you get a lot of potassium but you could go to the health food store and just buy a potassium pill, couldn't you? You could buy a potassium supplement, take that. When you do that, all you get out of it is the potassium. Whereas if you eat a banana, you get a lot of things done with, eating, with doing one thing. First of all, you get your potassium. Yeah, there's a lot of potassium in bananas. But you also get that pleasant taste in your mouth because they taste good. You get, that, you get rid of that hungry feeling that you had. You get your potassium. We talked about that. There's a lot of electrolytes in potassium. I mean in bananas, sorry. A lot of electrolytes in banana. And also there is something in bananas called mucilage, which helps the lining of your stomach. So, you know, just by eating one banana, you are taking care of a lot of different things without even trying to take care of them. Uh, my horse training is kind of the same thing. Recently I was doing a clinic in Northern California and I had this horse came in the arena and I'd started, I'd started desensitizing him. You know, I was just throwing this rope over his back. And when I first started doing this, he ran around and around and around and around and around and around and finally he stopped running around and of course I stopped doing it and gave him a rubbing and started doing it again. So I was working on this horse not being worried about this rope. Anyway, I was letting him stand still there for a bit and um, a lady in the crowd said, I've got a question for you. I've got this Arabian at home and he won't stand still. How do I go about, you know, how would you go about you know, teaching a horse to stand still? And I said, well, I've already started with this one and she said, well, no, you haven't. You've just been desensitizing so he's not scared of the rope. And I said, yes, when I threw the rope over him, he ran around and around and I kept doing it and he figured out running didn't work. What else can I try? And he tried standing still and that's when I stopped doing it. And I said, you notice this horse, you know, when he first came in the arena 10 minutes before, he was dancing and prancing and snorting and by this time he was standing still just like this one right here. And I said, so I have already started working on teaching him how to stand still without working on teaching him how to stand still. This, you know, working on the desensitizing, you're not just working on that. And when I'm training horses, I'm never working on one thing. What I'm doing now is taking care of numerous other things because it's just too much stuff to work on individually. Does that make sense? But anyway, that's my thoughts on why my horse training is like eating a banana. Hope that helps. See you guys next time.